Okay, I guess we're recording here. I have a new camera. Yeah, I guess it is. Uh, I have a new camera. Well, it's not brand new. I've had it a long time. I just have never used it. Just a web camera. Anyway, I, uh, I'm here. It's Sunday afternoon. I'm here in my den in my house. Uh, it's uh, going on 4 o'clock in the afternoon. It is Sunday, the 30th of May. May is almost over here, but it's amazing how quickly it's going. Anyway, um, it's my Friday. I just worked another week. I've been with the Bell Union now for almost two months. I love it there. It's a great job. I'm uh, running the bakery. I'm the bakery chef, pastry chef, so, or as my boss, when he introduces me to people, he introduces me as his chief baker, because there's more than one of us, but I'm the one that's in charge, chief baker, so uh, that's cool, I, uh, I just love my new job, it's, it's fabulous, it's, uh, it's pretty physically demanding, but I like it. I, I like what I'm doing. I, I just love it there. I, I believe that uh, the job was prearranged by the Lord in some way. He, uh, for four months, I applied at 42 main places all around the valley, and even in other towns, and couldn't find nothing. And then all of a sudden. I'm hired there. It's a baker. It's a, 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 I, I still think I'm dreaming. And uh, just I can't believe it. <laughs> anyway, it's a, it's a great job. I I really like it there. I, I enjoy it very much. But for the last month now, I've been fighting this Friday night after work, wanting to have what I used to do, my beer, my after work beer, and I got uh, one right here, uh, I'm doing it yet again, uh, uh, for the last um, four Sunday nights I've been coming home and uh, just one day a week, I've been coming home and having my relaxing in the afternoon with a few beers, uh, and uh, I know it's wrong. I gave this stuff up completely for so long, but now it seems like I'm back to it. I just can't seem to, to fight that off. Uh, it's very, uh, it's very strange. Now all of a sudden that things are going so good. I've got a great job and things are just going so good. Now all of a sudden I want to destroy what the Lord and I built, uh, you know, over this the last couple of years, getting me away from this and the tobacco and other things that I was addicted to. And, uh, and now I'm allowing this back into my life. And I don't know why. Just, you know, it's only one day a week, and that's all it's been, but I know if I keep it up, eventually it's going to be practically every day. But I love my beer. I just love the taste of my beer. It tastes very good. I, you know, I'm not gonna sit here and drink the whole night away and not go to sleep. I have my dinner. I'm making pizza out there in the living room. <laughs> the kitchen. <laughs> I laugh and giggle when I uh, have my beer. <laughs> anyway, uh, what what you hear in the living room is uh, the radio. That's K Apple playing. It plays all the time. But I was going to put a CD in here pretty soon, and I have a stopwatch because I got a <laughs> stopwatch. I got to stopwatch my video. I got to make sure I. Don't go over 10 minutes on my video, and I can't see it. I 
I can see it. Okay? So, uh, um, I've been doing this for five minutes now. So I'm just going to sit here and make some videos and talk about some things and listen to some of my music. You know, maybe I make too much out of this, just sitting around one day a week, you know, having beer. I know the Lord would tell me, you know, I don't want you to do that because it'll lead to other things. And he's absolutely right. It will, if I allow that. Uh, but he will, he'll let me drink this stuff if I want to. But there's going to be a price to pay. I'm very well aware of that. I understand that very well. And the obvious price that I'm going to pay is a hangover, and I'm actually killing brain cells, of course, and, and there's other prices to pay, too. But, uh, and, you know, I can't effectively do what he wants me to do. I can't minister like this. Obviously, if I'm addicted to this, I can't, or if I'm drinking this stuff all the time, well, we want it. I can't effectively be a minister. You know, the Bible's absolutely right in what it says about drinking, abusing alcohol and strong drink and all that. We're not to do that because we are not effective ministers. So anyway, it's just tonight, and uh, you know, I just so look forward to having my, to making my pizza and having this Sunday night uh, a few beers. You know, I won't get anything done tomorrow. I don't have to do anything tomorrow. There's nothing I have to do. I, you know, I don't have a family. I don't have children. Everything that I need to be doing, I don't have to do tomorrow. I got things done today, and so forth and so on, so I can take tomorrow and just, just kind of hang out here and watch some movies, you know, whatever, and work out. So I don't know, I'm not planning to keep this up. I wasn't planning to do this at all this week. But something happened at work yesterday that kind of made that decision for me, I guess. Something actually good and bad, uh, in a way, which we'll talk about. Actually, a bunch of things happened. Uh, one right on top of the other. We're going to come back in just a few moments and talk about weird who oh yeah say that I just say that all the time but uh, I'm gonna come back in a few minutes and uh, talk about that uh, what happened yesterday it's very strange so, uh, not funny anyway we'll be back in just a few moments with uh, with that